Hi my beauties and gents, it is Mama Day here. So I'm coming at you guys with the product review. Um, I was contacted by some I was contacted by somebody that was associated with Jensa Essentials. Jensa Essentials is a um, they do natural organic products. They are more so popular with their oils of their body or whatnot, but now they're getting into hair products. So um, I went met with them and I purchased I purchased with my very own money um, one of their hair product sets, which is the Grow and Glow. I am not being paid to do this video, and I'm giving you 100% of my opinion about all the products. So let's get to the business. I'm going to start with what I love all the way to what I least liked, okay? The very first one, which I freaking loved, was the Grow and Glow Conditioning Shampoo Butter. Again, it's 100% natural. Um, it is... No sulfates, no parabens, and no petrochemicals. Um, I love it. The smell, we'll start with smell first. Smells really, really good. Oh, I love the smell. I can't tell you what it is, but it's a floral scent. I'm going to get into the product, what it looks like. This is it. It is very thick, very viscous, and it reminds you of a butter. But, again, if you remember what I told you, the title of it is, is it is a conditioning shampoo butter what I love about this is what you do is you put this on dry hair not wet hair dry hair that's right you heard me right you're gonna section it off put it on from root to tip dry hair all throughout your hair and then you go into the shower and you wet your hair and it sets up immediately and you wash your hair down strokes ridiculous I was so utterly amazed by this because I thought it was like a pre a pre poo treatment but it's not it's actually a shampoo but you put it on dry which I love because with Rihanna I always had to pre pre poo her hair prep her hair with braids and I didn't have to do any of that her hair came out really soft very moisturized detangled like oh my gosh after she used that I was able to put my fingers all the way through her hair and just run through it and I've never been able to do that before totally impressed with that next the next product that I loved um I should probably put this in order because they have a conditioner but I'm going about what I like best they have a hair treatment oil um 100% organic whatnot I will put the ingredients of all the products below but this I love because oh it's just a great treatment you can use it as a hot oil treatment um, it helps with dry scalp control for press and curl transition from relaxed to natural great moisturizer um, it's a hundred percent oil so I don't know about it being a great moisturizer there's no water in this whatsoever um, but what I love about it is just to show you guys that little bit is for a good section amount of your hair you do not need a lot of this product and it just melts in your hair Whew, feels so good so yummy yummy love it and it just spreads throughout your hair i absolutely love that product next one of the grow grow and glow set say that three times is the light oil spray I love this when um, I unravel my hair like if I do a two strand twist and I want to do a twist out I spray this on my hair in the morning and then I unravel and it's great enough to give me a good slip so I won't grab onto any ends or anything and it just gives it great shine love this again all the products smell exactly the same the same product line which I love about that now the two that I'm kind of mm -mm about now Jasmine Rihanna I use this conditioning shampoo butter now the thing about this is because it's so conditioning and it's great shampoo slip you do not need to do a conditioner after this you this is it you wash your hair with this it conditions your hair you get out now I did however use a conditioner um their moisturizing conditioner on their hair as a deep moisturizer and then let them come out and I have to say for Rihanna um, you, you all have seen her hair she has a large amount of shrinkage on her hair and I braided her hair 
and she was like it's gonna shrink i know it's gonna shrink mom and it really did not shrink all that much it didn't shrink a lot i was really surprised about that i was very in awe over that and her hair was great detangled that but her hair was detangled really well i was shocked by it okay so now i'm gonna go into my thoughts on these two so you can tell already i'm not all that mm, not all that excited about it so the glow and grow moisturizing shampoo and then the glow and grow moisturizing conditioner first let me go into the conditioner so the conditioner has not a great slip i will show you the contents of it come on all right so this is it it just feels very watery if you see it it just doesn't I don't know. I don't have a great slip. I, I just think it feels very watery as if it's a leave-in conditioner and not so much that a daily um, conditioner that I would co-wash my hair with. Now, So let me get to the shampoo. This is called a moisturizing shampoo. You all know I'm a pH balance fanatic. So um, I use these products before I check them with the pH balance, which was totally my bad because I probably should have been prepared for it if I did. So this is a strip i use my ph strip for the moisturizing shampoo it is purple if you can see purple means it's a 13 that means it's alkaline that means this shampoo which was a 13 opened my cuticles all the way open so that water was going in and going right back out i'm talking about i put a quarter size on half of my hair i split in ponytails quarter size of shampoo in my hair and my hair felt like straw on that side i was like oh wow i didn't expect that at all did it on the other side same thing i was like oh my gosh so i wet it rinsed it out and then i did it again because i'm trying to clean my scalp up really good now i have to say to treat this as a clarifying shampoo yes i think it's great as a clarifying shampoo but for it to be titled a moisturizing shampoo and the way it stripped my hair no i don't think it was a very good moisturizing shampoo so then I used the moisturizing conditioner afterwards, hoping that it would give me that balance back. And my hair was just dry. And I'm talking about I had to wet my hair every day, put a little bit of this in it. If you can see, that's how much I have. Can you see how much I have left? Because every day that week I have been trying to co-wash it to get my balance back in my hair. I could not get the balance back. So I ended up taking my showing Shea Moisture um, Mask Deep Conditioner on my hair Friday and just letting it sit on my hair all day Friday night till Saturday morning, then rinsed it out and then co-washed it again and I got some of that balance back. But yeah, mm -mm, I didn't like it. And so then I thought I'm not going to use that shampoo again. I thought it was the shampoo. So I had to wash my hair today. Um, it's been a month. So I said, well, let me try it again. So I was prepared this time. So I did this quarter size again. But the difference is, is I took my Shea Suave, excuse me, my Suave Almond Shea Butter Conditioner and mixed it in with the shampoo. And that gave me the balance of a moisturized shampoo. And my hair didn't feel all that dry and I did it twice because if you can see see where it is now you compare all the other ones I've used I've hardly used any product that means this shampoo is gonna last forever that's a positive but it's the fact that I didn't use that much and it stripped my hair that dry and then after I rinse that out I conditioned with this I didn't condition with the moisturizing conditioner and I use the moisturizing conditioner as a leave-in conditioner. Now, as that, when I did that, it was great. It was good because then I followed it with the hair treatment oil, slicked it back, and I will give them this. I left this out on purpose so you guys can see. I don't know if you guys can see. So I will show you guys. Do you see that curl definition? Awesome curl definition. Now you guys know, if you've seen a couple of my videos where I talk about this section of my hair right here, always gives me a headache. It does not have great curl definition. I have to admit, after using all of these products that um, the curl definition has come back in that section of hair. 
before it's been really frizzy i'll show you a picture of what my hair used to look like um this is a frustrated look of me in that freaking pack of hair <laughs> So I will give it that. It brought the curl definition back to my hair. So I had some eh, and some yay, some good and some bad on it. Oh, so this was my honest opinion. I hope you guys liked it and you loved it. Overall, I'm triply excited about those products. And the other two, that's just my honest opinion. You can take from it what you will. Um, I never recommend products to anybody I mean, that's just you you take from your my opinion and you can try things out yourself because it doesn't work for my hair may work great for your hair and vice versa. You guys, that's my review. I hope you liked it. You loved it. I'll put the link below for Jensa Essentials. Again, thank you, gentlemen, for contacting me. And yeah, I hope you all love the review. So, all right, guys. Bye.